is the time in the show when we uh, check out what's new uh, on the Jazz Week Jazz Album Charts. And uh, let's uh, check that out. Um, before we get to the uh, top ten uh, countdown of the Jazz Week Jazz Album Charts, we were just featuring music from uh, Mike Longo and the New York State of the Art disc. And uh, that is a disc that is uh, now uh, in the highest day viewer on the list at 35 of the uh, top 50 that they list on the jazzweek.com jazz album charts. And, uh, and one more mention for the Mike Longo disc, it is the number one disc on the hot hits list um, here at Jazz 88 that you can find on the Jazz 88 Speakeasy at jazz88.org slash speakeasy. That new uh, Mike Longo disc uh, foreshadowing what's going to be happening on the charts, I believe. We'll see that one uh, coming up in the top ten. But let's get to it right now. It's the top ten countdown of the Jazz Week Jazz Album Charts for December 2nd, 2013. At number ten is Diego Rivera. The contender at number nine is Bill O'Connell and the ja and the Latin jazz all stars Zocalo. At number eight, Bob DeVoe and Shadowbox. At number seven, the most reported disc. So the most most radio stations reporting they're playing this disc is Joey D. Francesco's One for Rudy. At number six. Um, uh, Renee Marie's I Wanna Be Evil, a very uh, popular disc here at Jazz 88. At number five is Steve Therese, The Bones of Art. At number four, Houston Persons, Nice and Easy. At number three is Ahmad Jamal and the most, one of, another one of those most reported discs in jazz radio, Saturday Morning. At number two is the Jerry Gibbs Thrasher Dream Trio. Uh, and a disc, uh, self, a disc of that same name. And at number one, for nine straight weeks. We called it here on the New Jazz Thing uh, when we interviewed Gregory about seven weeks ago um, as he entered that top spot of the charts, and he has not relinquished it with his new release, Liquid Spirit. You can find that interview um, out uh, listed on the jazz88.org blog and on the jazz88.org speakeasy with Gregory Porter for Liquid Spirit. But he's, for nine straight weeks, the number one disc in jazz. And uh, because we really dig this disc here at Jazz 88, and we're uh, having a feeling that he is not going to be able to crack uh, number one with Gregory Porter, this is the Jerry Gibbs Thrasher Dream Trio, and a composition from the disc that features uh, Kenny Barron on piano, Ron Carter on the bass, and the leader Jerry Gibbs on drums. This is Here Comes Ron. You can find out uh, and listen live to the top 10 countdown of the Jazz Week Jazz Charts every Monday on the new Jazz Thing from 6 to 8 p.m. Pacific Time here at Jazz 88. It's all about the new on the new Jazz Thing, Jazz 88.3. <laughs>